Hey guys, it's me Minori and my pet Baymax. Welcome back to my channel. Hi! So I know it's been a while. How have you been? I know I only gave you guys an update on my Twitter. Don't forget to follow me there. So let me tell you guys what happened. So basically, I was very, very sick. It all started from having the corona, but things turned out to the worst. And I don't want to tell you guys too much about the sickness, but basically I had to go to the ER, which by the way, cost me $15,000. I couldn't eat, I was in immense pain, and I lost 15 pounds and I'm currently like 75 pounds. So yeah, I just decided to give my body a rest. And please don't feel bad for me or anything because ultimately, it was the best thing that ever happened to me. Apparently, my doctor believes that this was the reason why I miscarried my baby a few months ago. And this whole thing was just like a wake up call. And now I really, really believe that I'm gonna be healthier than ever before. Plus, while everything was hectic, I mean, it was really, really hard. It was really nice going back to my parents' place and feel like a child again. And now that I'm back in Japan, I'm living with my brother right now, and we're just playing Pokemon every night. Honestly, this whole thing is like the sweetest memory ever, and probably like 20 years from now, I'm gonna look back and be super happy that I dealt with all of this. I believe that whatever happens is a blessing in disguise, and it's really how you perceive things. And while I'm not like 100% there yet, I'm ready to make videos again. Excuse me? Ta-da! So here, I have a lot of mystery boxes. So if you guys don't know, mystery boxes or lucky bags is a thing in Japan the first week of January. So um, I got a lot of boxes and this probably all cost me over a thousand dollars. I bought a lot because I wanted to open these not only on this channel but also my other channel and do a lot of videos. But now because of all of my troubles, I'm totally late to the game. So you know what guys, I'm just gonna box all of this today. This video may be a little bit long but let's just get to it. Unboxing a thousand dollars worth of mystery boxes. Let's get started. So which one should I unbox first? That is the question. These are some art supplies. These, um, I actually don't know because I kind of forgot. But I want to start with this one. This is a mystery bag for bags. I get it every single year and I just love it so much. So, oh, it's so heavy. Let's start with this one. The reveal. It's so cute! I already love this bag! It's so big, but it's so sturdy and so useful! And it's so pink! <laughs> My favorite color. I mean, I love the bag itself, but this isn't the mystery. Let's see what we got. Ooh, oh, ah. <laughs> okay, that's a lot of stuff. By the way, this brand is called Samantha Tabasa. It's a really popular brand in Japan. And honestly, each item isn't that cheap. So first off, we have... Ta -da! A small card case. This is $100. Hmm. I mean, this bag itself was like $200 to $300, I think. So let's see if I get my money's worth. Ooh, it's simple and nice. I love this red. So here's my first item. Let's keep on going. Second item we have... Ah, a small wallet. And this one retails for $165. So it's like a small brown wallet. But do you guys see the shimmer and the glitter? And if you open it... <gasps> It's purple or like a pinkish purple inside. Ooh, it's so pretty. It has two pockets, some card slots. It opens easily. And yeah, it's really, really nice. By the way, anything that I don't like or not gonna use, I'm going to give it away. So don't worry, it's not going to waste. So next, here we got a shoulder strap. Interesting. Ooh, $117. Okay, I mean, I need a bag. I need a bag to use this, but it's like a really nice thick strap. It sits nicely on my shoulder. So let's see what I can do with it. But next up, we have a small purse. And this one retails for $300. So honestly, I've already got my money back, which is a nice thing to know. Oh, and there's more shoulder straps inside. <gasps> That's cute, like a rupee strap and a small bag to keep your purse inside. So honestly, this isn't my favorite bag. The color is really not for me, but I mean, it's really pretty. And pause, let me tell you guys about the sponsor of this video, Merge Gardens. I've actually been playing it on my own free time, so even if it's sponsored, it's really not. I don't know, it's just so satisfying like cleaning the garden. And whenever I'm bored, like when I'm waiting for a seat at a restaurant, I just open this app without really thinking. So Merge Gardens is basically a game where you get to make your own garden and solve some puzzles at the same time. But now that they've made a major change, you get to solve some mysteries now. Let me show you how it looks. So guys, 
this is my garden. I know it kind of looks crazy right now, but even if you clean it, it kind of gets messy after a few hours. Let me quickly clean it. So you get like three of the same items and merge it together and you make it into like one big one and you basically repeat this step until it's clean you can sell some items for money and make the garden look even fancier ooh money 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 i don't know it's just so satisfying cleaning the garden and making it pretty you can also play a mini game from this arrow right here oh, so satisfying there's also this new mystery story going on some cute events, and a lot is happening right now. I really enjoy this game, so I really hope you guys like it too. It also helps me if you guys check out the app because I get to make more videos with the help of sponsors. So please check out the link from the description box below or from this QR code. And guys, it's free. So yeah, thank you to Merge Gardens again for sponsoring. And let's go back to the video. And next, another bag. And it's yellow! Ooh. This is a really interesting design. Like, I mean, the strap, and it has like this gold thing. This one costs $400. Hmm. And inside we've got nothing. It's really spacious, and it's so unique. I don't know if I'm gonna use it or not, but I do like how it's so unique. And I feel like one of my friends is gonna really, really like this because she really likes this color. And oh! I saved the best for last. Last item inside this bag, we have a really nice sized bag. And it looks something like, <gasps> it's black. Ooh, this bag is around $400. I'm impressed. Oh, it's so useful. I love how you can like easily put it on your shoulders. And when you open it, we've got some more straps and it's so spacious. Like you can fit like everything inside here. Can you fit a laptop inside here? Let me try. Can you? I think you could. Okay, you can't. <laughs> My laptop is a little bit too big, but it's definitely gonna fit like a small one. There's like a slit right here. This is the main area and another pocket on the outside. Wow, what do you guys think? I mean, for all of this, I'm super impressed. Overall, I'm just so satisfied. I'm probably going to donate a few, but I'm just having some trouble which to choose. And again, I also love this outer bag. You can literally use this for anything. So yeah, first box, check. Okay, next one. It's so heavy, but these are all art items. Anything art, I'm gonna be happy with. Let's see what I got. So first box, two, three, and four. Let's start with the smaller boxes. So this one is called the watercolor set. Ta-da! First we've got a calendar. I mean, it's a small cute calendar. And here's the real deal. <gasps> it's gold! <laughs> I actually kind of want to save this paper. Anyways. Ah! So here we've got a watercolor pad. This is like really, really nice paper. I could feel the difference. Can you guys see the texture on this paper? I don't know if the camera's picking up, but look at the thickness and how sturdy it is. I've never used paper like this before. Let's see how it works. And next, ooh, there's a lot of items for such a small box. This is called a watercolor book. That's so cute. I've always wanted something like this. Again, really nice quality. And there's a lot of pages. I've seen a lot of TikToks and like short videos of people like painting in small books. They bring it around everywhere and they just start painting on the spot. I wanted to do something like that as well. And this is like perfect. And next, we've got some watercolors. I mean, it is the watercoloring set. It looks like a bean, <laughs> like a jelly bean. And it looks something like this. Okay, wow, this is a really nice palette. So it comes with a brush and there's one, two, three, four, five, six, 18 different colors. And there's a small palette on this side. You just like bring these two on a trip and you can just start painting. So easy, so clean. And wait, there's more. Here we've got some colored pencils. I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong, but it's the whole vein. Please correct me if I'm wrong. But I know these are like a nice brand. Interesting colors. They have lavender, blue green, warm gray, orange. And since they're not like the typical colors, they're gonna make the art unique. Oh, I love it. We have a water brush. These are so useful. I can never get enough of these. I love the tip. It's a flat brush. So soft and smooth. 
You could like put water inside here. Wow, this is a nice water brush. And lastly, we've got another drawing book. This one's not as high quality as the other ones, but I could honestly never have enough papers. I am so happy with what I got. I'm gonna use every single item here. Yay! Next box is called the Rose Set and the Reveal. Again, this gold paper is just so pretty, I can't throw it away. And here we got <gasps> nice, all these items. First things first. Wow, this brush is so long. Wow, but this brush itself costs $30. That's insane. And it's like a fan brush. I've never used like a fan brush before. So it's like a great time to learn something new. I feel like I could balance this. Oh, 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 see that? See that? <laughs> Anyways, here we've got. I wonder if it's like a bag. Hmm. I guess this is for your brush. And it's like perfect for something like this. You could just like roll it up and stuff. It's always nice to have a home for your brush. Next up, these I'm guessing are acrylic paints. Oh no, oil paints. So this color is called rose gray. Again, a very interesting color. I wonder why that's called the rose set. I guess they put in a lot of rosy colors. This one is called rose matter. Oh my gosh, it looks so expensive. So it's like a really muted pinky color. And it's so funny, this one's called Mino. And you know, I'm Minori. <laughs> oh, totally random by the way. Um, I actually checked the site called Famous Birthdays and it said that my real name is Minnie. So some people actually called me Minnie on this channel, but no, that wasn't my real name. My nickname is Minnie, just so you know. Okay, let's go on to our next box. Okay, this box is called the tissue box. <laughs> we'll see what it means. Are you guys ready? The reveal. Ta-da! Okay, so first off, again, we got a calendar. Oh, this is so pretty. I've never seen this one before. The Ecoline brush pen. So I'm just gonna use the book that I got in my other box and let's try out some markers. Let's see. Ooh, this is like a really interesting color. And it looks, ooh, okay. So it's like a brush pen that's like a marker. Oh, it's so pretty! Wait, I love these! Oh. I mean, can you guys see this? It's so juicy. Can you see that fade? It kind of fades out. So they're like watercolors, but like as a marker. Let me try a few more colors. And they're also very vibrant. I'm impressed. And how many do we have here? 59 colors. And we also have a blender. I need more of these. I'm definitely gonna add this into my collection. And I probably would have never gotten it if it weren't for this box, which makes it extra special. That's why I love mystery boxes. And guys, don't forget, it's called the tissue box. And here we found some like tissue boxes. <laughs> Can you see that? It's actually a tissue box, but I guess you could like paint it and make it original. That's fun. Oh, and there's more. Wow, there's a lot of stuff in here. You guys see this smile? I haven't smiled this big for a very long time. I'm about to cry. Oh, I mean, I did go through a lot and it's so nice to be happy about the like the little things. Anyways, I've seen this one before. Another book, some wood carving tools, and here we've got old wood wax beige gray. I kind of want to open it to see what color it is, but I don't want to get like everything everywhere. I don't have any plans on like DIYing wood, but again, we'll see. It's always nice to try something new. And lastly, but not least, an acrylic kit. Ooh, how do you use this? So you open it like this. And there's like a lot of different palettes inside. Oh wait, there's paint inside. Oh wait, this is so nice. It has like everything here. <gasps> this is fun. And it's literally called the fun set. One, two, three, four, 13 colors. It also comes with like brushes, three brushes, and a dotting tool, a small towel, and a ruler. This is like a really great set for like beginners. Ooh, I might give this one away. Oh wait, I thought this was a tissue box. This is a tissue box, but this is just a box. And there's nothing inside. But I mean, it's gonna be really fun to like craft this. I feel like I'm going to donate these, but I'm really happy with this brush pen. And I think this kit is so fun, super original. I love it. And the biggest box out of all, and it's called the wire art set. Why did I get this? 
I don't remember why I got this, but this is gonna be another fun box, I think. I mean, the other boxes were so small, but it had a lot of stuff inside. Imagine how much this one has. And, oh, oh my gosh. It's like filled to the brim. Let's open this one by one. So I see a lot of stuff that I've seen before, like this book. It's the same one that was in the watercolor book. But I mean, I don't mind having 10 of these. It's always nice to have more. Calendar. <laughs> I actually got this last year. I actually turned mine into Totoro. I've already played with this one before, so I think I'm gonna donate this. But wait, <laughs> I thought it was gonna be a lot of different art supplies, just like the other mystery boxes. But no, it seems to be all the same, but in different colors. It's like filled with colored wires. That's a lot of wires. Can you guys see this? It's so heavy, and there's just like so many of these. Guys, look! 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 50 of these, literally, in all different colors and sizes. I've never done wire art before, and I thought they were gonna give me like a few, but they gave me so many of these. I don't know what I'm gonna do with these. I mean, the color's really pretty. This one's silver, gold, yellow. There's like thicker ones, shorter ones. It's just a lot. Oh, this one's really pretty. It's like a iridescent violet pretty color. Okay, um, how about I like make some like wall decorations? Or like make those signs, you know, and put it on the back. I'm sure there's a lot of ideas. And it's so nice to have so many different colors. And lastly, inside this box, we've got some perler beads. Perler beads, iron beads, same thing. I used to love these. I think I've made a few videos about this before. And I guess that's it for this box. So here I've got some more art boxes, but before I open this, I want to open this bag with you guys. And this is a mystery bag from Mariah Elizabeth. She's a queen and I love her so much. This isn't a part of the Japan mystery boxes, but I got this a while ago and I thought it's like perfect for this video. So let's see what I got. So first, I got this Pickles backpack. It's so cute! It's Pickle! Oh my gosh! Ooh, it's so cushiony! And look at the scrap! And it has like cans. And if you open it, ooh! I love how it's so wide. And you can fit a lot of stuff in here. And there's a pocket on the outside and look at this charm! A pickle charm. I don't think I'm gonna use it on like a daily basis. But I mean, I think I can pull it off. So first we got a backpack, and <laughs> next, oh my gosh guys, we've got two rackets. <laughs> Eugene and Shelly, right? I think. She has so many different characters, but I remember her painting these on her shoes, and they're so cute. It'll be like a really cute decoration. I want to put these like right here. What do you guys think? I love supporting my fellow YouTubers, and Mariah is literally a legend in my book. And next, we got a t-shirt! Yes! Ooh, it's so soft. Aww. Look at this, guys. The color is so me, and the cake and the ice cream. I'm definitely going to use this on a daily basis. And oh, yes, this isn't part of the mystery box, but I also got her art set. I've been dying to try these out. And look at this bundle. Oh, everything is just so cute. Mariah, I just love you so much. I just really hope I can collab with you one day. Just saying. <gasps> look at this, guys. This is so unique. Oh, the brushes. I guess something happened to the brushes. Oh, that's kind of sad. But to me, it's not a big deal. Other than that, I think this is a really, really pretty kit. It has a lot of dotting tools. Ooh, both sides. And over here, we've got some acrylic paint, the bumblebear, milk chocolate, strawberry. Oh, strawberry, like a bear. It's also great for beginners. Guys, please check her out. She's amazing. And you can roll it back. Okay, let's move on. Okay, it's been an hour and 30 minutes. That's a lot of unboxing, but we still have more. I think this is an art box, I think, but it doesn't have like any tag or anything, so I'm not sure. Let's see what's inside. Guys, these two rackets make the background so cute. I love it. Ta-da! That's a lot of stuff again, and there's a mystery box inside a mystery box. Let's open this one first. 
<laughs> Ooh, okay. Wow, this looks really high quality. It looks really expensive. Windsor and Mutant? Oh wow! <laughs> it's a watercolor set. It doesn't have the price anywhere, but I'm sure it's pretty expensive. Like, I could feel it. For example, this is a single brush. But this container is like so over the top for a single brush. And it's magnet! Wow, this is like a really nice ASMR. I don't know if I could use this, guys. I don't want to like mess this up. And here we go. One, two, three. 18 colors of watercolors and again they're just so pretty so professional i cannot use this at least for a while i need to get more into watercoloring and i need to practice a lot more before i get to use these and on the top oh, this feels so nice and they're all glued together on the sides that always means it's really high quality cold pressed 100 percent cotton superior strength and it looks really really thick but there's only 20 pages which means each page is so thick and so durable and lastly it comes with a tote bag wow this is definitely worth my money but like i said i think i'm gonna keep this aside and wait until i'm like better at least for now and we've still got more oh this is such a nice box and there's more oh oh what is this no wonder why it was so heavy. It's an art field bag. Oh my gosh. So it's like a backpack. So you can carry it around. You could open it like so. And oh, can you guys see it? <laughs> it's a little bit big, but it basically turns into a seat. It's sturdy. It's a nice backpack. And I guess you could put a lot of art supplies inside. And yeah, it's a seat. I guess I could use this not only for art, but for like camping, hiking. And like I said in the very beginning, I've always wanted to like bring around my art items and just like paint on the spot outside. And this is like perfect for it. I would have never thought about getting this. Oh, these mystery boxes are so fun. And so here we've got more sketchbooks and some more acrylic paint. And I actually got this last year and I love them so much. So they're the bigger tube version. They're so smooth. I use these all the time. Love it. And lastly, here we've got some pencils. Again, it's very extra. I mean, for colored pencils, oh my gosh. How do I open this? Okay, wait. Oh, wait, what? Um. <gasps> oh, wait. Guys, see that? So it's not like a box. There's more space to grow. You could use it as like a display. Should I put it in my background? You know, there's so many unique art supplies. And this box is just like, psh, mind blown. I mean, this was all inside one single box. Wow, this is a lot to take in. <laughs> and you know what, guys? We actually have one more box. So this is our last box. And the reveal. Ta-da! My receipt. And this is the mixed media set. So I'm guessing there's a lot of different kind of mediums. I already see something that I like. First off, we've got some paint. More paint. By the way, I do use a lot of paint. Just looking at them makes me really happy. And they're all like different kinds of brands. So I get to like play with all of these and choose which one works the best for me. And oh, this looks so cute. One, two, three, four, five, six. 12 different colors and each tube is a really nice size and I love how bold they are very standard and very useful and some watercolors three two one oh <laughs> you can't see anything yet Ta -da! and you still can't see anything yet okay <laughs> 12 colors. Again, very basic colors, but very useful. And ooh, a Chinese white. I wonder what makes it Chinese. Again, basic colors. Love it. More colored pencils. And they're like bright colors. Neon colors. And more colored pencils. And these are all like the shimmery metallic colors. Gold, silver, copper, antique silver. Interesting. And more oil pastels. Yes, I don't have any pastels. So pretty! I don't have any oil pastels, so I'm definitely going to keep these. And I think this is the last item of the day. Oh wait. <laughs> okay, um, it's actually the same thing that I got in my other box. It's the Charisma colored pencils. Guys, remember the one that opens like this? 
So I guess I got two of these, which means I'm probably going to donate one. And guys, I think that's it for today. So guys, after two hours of unboxing, which is a lot, I am finally done. Wow, that was a lot. Which one did you guys like the most? I can't choose because they're just so precious. And I'm probably gonna use like 90% of these, but anything that I'm not gonna use, I'm gonna donate. And yeah, I had a lot of fun. After like two months of suffering, this was a really, really nice time for me. And guys, thank you guys so much for watching my videos. I couldn't say a proper goodbye last year and a proper hello this year, but like you guys mean the world to me. I'm ready to make more videos this year. I'm just ready to have more fun this year. There's more to come. Please stay tuned. I'll see you guys next video. Bye!